hi everyone happy tuesday welcome back to the chosen one by ashley welcome back to my channel if you're new thank you so much for joining thank you so much for your support today i would like to pray for everyone today prayer is god help us as we go through life changes help us to get back up and to get our mind right on you help us to communicate to you specifically let's pray Father, in the mighty name of Jesus, we thank you for life, health, and strength. We thank you for waking us up. We thank you for clothes, food, Lord God. We thank you, Father, for a shelter, Lord God. We thank you, Father, for blessing us, Father, with many, plenty things, Lord God. We ask, Father, that you watch over us and protect us, Father. We thank you, Father, for life changes, Lord God. We ask, Father, that you just protect us and keep us, Father, everywhere we go, Father. We ask, Father, that your protection, your healing be over us, Father. We ask, Father, that you just watch Watch over us and guide us, Father, and help us, Father, even though we're going through life changes, Father, as we get older, Father, help us to remember things. Help us, Father, to understand what you want us to do, Lord God. Help us, Father, to get closer to you, Father. Help us, Father, to be pacific with you when we're talking, Father. Help us, Father, learn how to pray, how to fast, how to just submit ourselves to you, Father doing anything that we're going through, Father. Help us, Father, to communicate with you, Lord God. Help us, Father, to give you our heart. Give us everything that we need, Father. Help us, Father, to just love on you, Father, like never before, Lord God. Help us, Father, to repent anything that we're doing, Father, out of your will, Father. Help us, Father, to just be real and be honest about it, Lord God. I ask, Father, that you watch over us and protect us, Father. Touch our children name by name. Touch their schools, Lord God. Bring them back home safely, Lord God. Watch over our children. Watch over us, Father. In the name of Jesus, Lord God, I ask, Father, that your protection, your healing is around us, Father. Everywhere we go, Father, have your surroundings around us, Lord God. Have your security, Lord God. In the name of Jesus, protect us, Father, around the four walls, Father, that we're sitting in, Father. Help us, Father, in the name of Jesus, Father. I ask, Father, that you watch us. In the name of Jesus, Father, touch our family, touch our loved ones, Father, that is in different cities, different countries, Lord God. Watch over them, Father, in the name of Jesus, Father. Allow your protection to be around this world, Lord God. Help us, Father, to change our life around. Help us, Father, to understand, Father, what you're doing, Father, in the name of Jesus. Lord God, move people, Father, that don't supposed to be in our life, Father. Move them away from us, Father, in the name of Jesus, Father. I ask, Father, that you watch us, Father. Keep us in your will, Father. Protect us this month, Father. Let this month, Father, that we complete things that you want us to do, Father. Help us, Father, to cry out to to you this month. Help us, Father, to put you first this month. Help us, Father, to follow our dreams, our goals, our purpose this month, Father. Help us, Father, to not be distracted this month, Father. I ask, Father, that you bless us and keep us, Father. Help us, Father, this month, Father, to stay focused. Help us, Father, in the name of Jesus, to complete the things that we need to get done, Lord God. I ask, Father, that you remove any haters, anyone that is talking down on us, anyone that is trying to trick us or kill us father i ask father that you move it away from us father and you send it where you want us to go lord god i ask father that you touch the babies father that is in the stomach lord god allow them father to make it full term lord god i ask father that you touch everyone that is watching me father whatever they want to receive this my father allow them to receive it lord god I declare and I decree, Father. I ask, Father, that you just touch everyone, name by name, Father. Help them, Father, all over the world, Father. Help them, Father, to find you, Father. Help them, Father, to seek you, Father, like never before, Father. You know what they're going through, Father. Help them, Father, in the name of Jesus, Father. I ask, Father, that your angels be around us, Father, like never before, Father. Touch us, Father, in the name of Jesus, Father. Keep us safe in your arms, Father. We love you and we praise you, Father. We lift you up, Father. Help us to eat right father help us to watch what we put in our body help us father to drink water help us father to put you in our diet lord god help us father to feed ourselves the word of god lord god in the name of jesus father help us father to eat healthy father and just stop eating all this junk food father and eating crazy help us father to watch what we put in our system lord god help us father to exercise help us father to take care of our bodies in the name of jesus i ask father that 
that you just touch us and heal us, Father. Anyone that is in the hospital room, Father, protect them and keep them, Father. Bring them back home safely, Father. In the name of Jesus, touch our vehicles, Lord God. Touch the trains, the buses, Lord God. Touch the road, Father. Touch the street lights. In the name of Jesus, that's working right. In the name of Jesus, Lord God, let your protection, your healing be on us, Father. Control us, Father. In the name of Jesus, watch over us. Father, in the name of Jesus, help us, Father, to get things done today, Father. In Jesus' name I pray, amen and amen. God bless you all. I just want to say, continue to put God first in everything you do. It's very important that you pray. When you pray, it's important because it opened up the doors. It opened up the doors so God can remove some things. It's very important. I tell people this all the time. The reason why you need to pray because you don't know what was planned that day. The devil is busy in this season. He is trying to kill, steal, and destroy. Us as believers, us as Christians, we need to stand on God firm. It doesn't matter what you're going through. Stand on God. Make sure you're putting God first in your life. The reason why you need to pray because the devil has something planned. The same time God have something planned for you, the devil have something planned too. You can be on your way going to an interview and the devil can cut you off. That's why we pray. The reason why we pray to remove every trap, every demon that is trying to poison our days. It's very important that you pray. Pray every day when you wake up in the morning. Make it a habit. The same way you can wake up and watch TV, the same way you can wake up and eat a bowl of cereal, wake up and put God first. Put God first before you eat a meal. Put God first before you go outside on the porch. Start putting God first and watch how your life change before your eyes. It's important that you feed yourself the word of God before you feed yourself a bowl of cereal. Remember to pray and don't give up. God bless you. Thank you for watching. I, I pray that this prayer had helped y'all, and I pray that you get something out of it. Change your life because God wants you to. It's important that you give your soul to the Lord. He loves you and he cares for you. He wants the best for you. I love you. Have a great, beautiful day. Be encouraged. God bless you all.